So we're here in Indonesia and we've always heard that you can't come here without trying Richie's factory and you can't come to Richie's factory without trying their level five fire chicken. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. The six piece fire wings. Does that seem right? Yeah. Okay, I'll some French fries. Ooh, potato pom pom sound cool. Mm. Okay, I'll do it too. I'll be. I'll so you're gonna do a level five I'm hot sauce challenge? All right, you're gonna do six. I should probably do whatever's the last year. Three. One, three piece, one six piece. Oh, that's all? Five. Five? Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> Anything else? French fries. Medium plus? Uh, medium. All of that came out to only 139,000 rupees. It's gonna be hot. I hear it's hot. Sure are. Pretty much that's the you. Alright, so I initially was not going to take part in this challenge, but now that we're here, I think I'm going to do it. And I ordered the level 5 spicy chicken wings. I've only got three of them though, Mike got six, and hopefully I'll be able to eat the three. <laughs> we'll see. I'm a little excited, I'm a little bit nervous. We got chicken wings, which feels like when you're doing a hot challenge, chicken wings is just the classic thing to do. It comes with cheese sauce, which I think is interesting. Now I know why it's called rich cheese, because it all comes with cheese sauce. I was very confused. I thought it was like Richie's, but it's rich cheese. We both got French fries, and she told me that I got a mango tea, and Ashley got a coconut drink. Ashley believes the coconut drink is strawberry. I guess we'll see what it is when it gets here. This seems to be like the popular fast food chain here in Indonesia. We're gonna find out how spicy these wings are and hopefully I can handle them because I'm actually hungry. I don't want to not be able to eat my food. I'm kind of nervous. I can handle spice pretty well. Not quite as much as Mike can, but yeah, I think this is gonna be really, really spicy. <laughs> They look very saucy. Ooh, I'm nervous. Me and Mike are debating. He thought the lady said that this was a coconut drink, but I'm pretty sure that it tastes like strawberry, so. It smells like strawberry. It tastes like bubblegum. <laughs> you need like gloves or something, but they don't give you any. So, we're just gonna do this. All right, so it is a full chicken wing that's been breaded. And these look really, really saucy. They are just, oh man. All right, are we doing it? Yeah. Mmm. So they're barbecue. Hmm. So they are spicy. <coughs> okay, that one kicked me in the back of the throat. They are definitely spicy, but I honestly expected them to be way hotter than they are. They do burn though. They're pretty good. Well, Ashley's eating her wings and cleaning her hands off before I hand her the camera. I'm gonna try these french fries with some of this cheese sauce. Mmm. The cheese sauce is good. It tastes like nacho cheese that you would find in the States, but it's a little sweet, which is a little odd. I'm gonna also try this mango tea real quick. Oh wow, the mango tea is delicious. It's super good. Very sweet, very mango-y. Right. Pink drink, is it? Kind of tastes like medicine, like antibiotics you would get as a kid. Maybe it's the jamu. Oh, maybe it is jamu. We learned about jamu when we went to the Sultan's Palace. We'll talk more about that later. So, Ashley said they're kind of barbecue-y flavor. Mmm. Yeah, they're hot, but... They're more sweet than hot. Maybe they gave us level one. Mm 
I feel that there's pepper in there. But it's not like an instant burn. Should we be spreading? Because you definitely have sauce on it. No. I feel like I need wet wipes still. It's got a lingering heat for sure. Okay, I take it back. I was trying to film Mike while he was trying his wings, and I'm over here behind the camera like panting. <laughs> they kind of creep up on you. For a bite or two, they're spicy but not overwhelming, but then it builds and builds and builds. I've only tried one wing out of my three, and my mouth and my lips are on fire. <laughs> I do think I'll be able to eat the rest of these, but I think I may have spoken too soon. Not that spicy. These definitely are pretty spicy. <laughs> It builds for sure. It's like not an initial heat. It's almost like an extract, you know? You can be able to finish them. It's more that they're just messy. They're messy. Finger licking chicken. They're hot, but not the hottest thing I've ever had. I feel like I got some milk, some sniffles there. <laughs> I feel like I feel it on my lips more than I feel it in my mouth. Yeah, Ooh, I need to try dipping it in the cheese sauce. Mm. Alright, so what would you rate these? As far as flavor? Yeah. They're really good. Eight? What about texture? A little sloppy. Breading is really loose, so it falls off a lot. And there's a little too much sauce, not for the flavor, but just for the like, it's <laughs> like everywhere. Would you order them again? Maybe. I'd eat like a chicken sandwich that was covering that. It'd be really good. Yeah, if they did like a chicken sandwich that had like coleslaw to kind of balance the heat out, that'd be really good. Cool, it'd be so good with coleslaw. That'd be a nice balancer. Yeah. They are hot though. Mm. Honestly, you've ever eaten? No, not at all. I think those noodles that we ordered in Banyu Wangu were really hot. The thing is with this, it's like, it's hot if you eat all six wings and don't take a drink. The minute you take a drink, it's almost like, oh, my mouth, they're definitely hot. Like, don't get me wrong. Don't come here and be like, oh, they're not hot at all. I can do that. If you can't handle hot food, it's gonna kick your butt. It's definitely lingering and making me be like, oh my God, it's a little bit hotter than I expected it to be, but I don't think it's gonna like, jump in a cold ice bath hot. How many left? I'm done. You're done? Yeah. Oh, damn. Good job. Yeah. Now I gotta finish mine. Okay. Oh no. Are you good? They are hot. It builds and builds and builds. <laughs> I need cheese sauce. Mm. The fries are really good. <laughs> Enak, Peras Enak. Spicy delicious? Yeah. <laughs> you ready to go? Yeah, I think so. All right, Ashley's turn. All right, ready for more pain. <laughs> you got this, babe. <laughs> oh, this is a big one. All right. I want to try to not get it on my lips, <laughs> but I don't think it's possible. Mm. 
They're very tender. They fall off the bone. What's your favorite part about Indonesia? The food. <laughs> Honestly, probably the volcanoes. It's such a beautiful place. I've never been into hiking or anything like that, nor waking up in the middle of the night to do so. And I've done it twice now, and I'm already looking for another volcano that we can hike. <laughs> I thought you said last one is the last one. <sighs> yeah, I thought so too. <laughs> now you're obsessed. Mm. Can't get you to hike mountains. But you love yourself some volcanoes. It's just so beautiful. It's just such an un like a different landscape than anything I've ever seen before. So it's kind of cool. Oh, and yeah, these are really hot. Volcano hot. Yeah. Oh. The pink stuff was. I don't see any sweat here. I feel it in my eyeballs. <laughs> I'm actually surprised you tried it. It hurts. We're almost there. We only had three. <sighs> I feel like you burned yourself dipping it in some cheese sauce. Yeah, I think so too. Ooh. It is hot. I definitely spoke too soon. What's your favorite part about travel? <sighs> Experiencing new cultures, seeing different landscapes. I do not like this, but it really helps neutralize the the heat. This tastes amazing, but it doesn't do anything for the heat. That like instantly like cools it down. I should have been drinking more of that. <laughs> Whoa. Um, let's see. What surprised you the most about Indonesia? Mm. The food. I honestly didn't... I didn't expect to like it, and I love it. It's one of my favorite cuisines. And I really didn't expect it. Is that your last one? Yep. Oh. How you doing there, champ? My eyeballs are sweating. <laughs> Get you some pink cream. I think I burned an ice cream. Ooh, I do think you burned an ice cream. <laughs> you need to find a mix here. Or do they have ice cream here? I'll this later. <laughs> Ow. My tongue hurts. <laughs> I bet you're supposed to dip it in the cheese to neutralize it a little bit. But I'm not a wimp. Oh man. They're good though. If you guys can do the level five, tag us on Instagram. I want to see it. I bet I'm tougher than some of you boys. We finished our wings. I think we've earned us some ice cream and Ashley says they have ice cream here. So I'm gonna go get us like a cone or whatever variant of ice cream they have. Help cool things down. Let us know down in the comments below if you've been to Richie's or if it's something you think you could try and yeah. We're gonna get some ice cream. I'll be right back. All right. You happy about your ice cream? <laughs> I've recovered. 
They have chocolate and vanilla. And we got both. And Ashley's going to double dip them. Let's <laughs> make you a happy lady. Instantly pulls it off like I'm good now. <laughs> <laughs>